those crackers, the trans covenant killer wrote, using the same anti-white language being used in PUSD today, as my daughter's friend was called a cracker in the quad at Del Norte. I warned about rampant racism in the district, and many parents and students spoke at recent school board meetings about it. I provided more than adequate documentation for this to all the people in front of us, and none of these concerns have been addressed. So now that we know people are being radicalized by anti-white ideology to shoot up schools, are we going to stop the anti-white rhetoric in this district? Teachers and administrators told me and my daughter that white male perspective needs to be done away with and that we need to rewrite the textbook because it's too white. Part of our curriculum actually says that white people are unconsciously oppressive and that white people believe every negative word about people of color. This shows that our DEI program is either not working or that the actual goal of our DEI program is to foment hatred of whites. How is it possible that this hateful stereotyping of white people is not known by the teachers of these classes? The curriculum some of this hateful language comes from has no references, but it's being taught as fact in our ethnic studies program and other places. I asked for this before and I'm asking again. We need to have transparent, objective measures for our DEI programs to either make sure they're working for our students or shut them down. Also, any and all curriculum used in our school district must have credible references in order to verify accuracy of the material that they're being taught 